Hey my nerds, it's time to bring your creative A game to the party. I personally love creating stories that feel different from the mainstream. So how can you do it too? Easily if you adopt this one trick. It's one of my primary writing rules and it's applicable whether you're creating characters, plot, building your world, whatever. And the trick is to ignore that voice telling you that something is impossible. In fact, when your brain tells you something is impossible or too difficult to do, those are the ideas that you need to pounce on. The impossible is where the other authors are fearing to tread. The impossible is where the markets are less well-defined and where you're more likely to be noticed for creating something new. Like I said, you can use this trick at whatever stage of your story creation process you're at, but it's easier at the earlier stages since that's when it's easier to create around your idea rather than having to try and force it to fit with a story you've already worked out a lot of the parameters for. Just trust me, it's not worth it. I did it once and I ended up having to redraft a story so much that I might as well have just started from scratch. So instead of doing that, when you're starting a story, try casting your mind out for the weird factor. My favorite are those that can be integrated across all aspects of my setting, plot and characters, helping create something that feels complete and thought through. So how do you come up with your weird factor? There are a lot of different ways. The easiest in fantasy is through your magic system. If you are someone whose imagination is on hyperdrive, those ideas probably just spring out of your subconscious unbidden. If not, it's always okay to give those ideas a helping hand. Actively search for inspiration out there. There are lots of concepts explored in other genres that have never been addressed through fantasy. Bringing them across is a quick way of doing something new in fantasy. Another is the method of scrapping your first few ideas. I did this technique when ideating for Last Memoria. I knew I wanted the main character to have magic powers of some sort, and at first I was thinking of your more typical magics like fire and chaos magic but they've been done a lot so I kept pushing discarding ideas until my brain said well that would be just impossible and that was the idea I latched onto. so however you come up with your weird factor what's important is that you don't discard it my brain is forever telling me certain ideas are impossible and yet I always found a way to make those ideas work that is the beauty of the fantasy genre so don't just ignore that naysaying voice, grasp onto the ideas and delve into them. Pick at them by asking what that would mean like I showed you how to do in the first video. You'll be amazed by the stories you create as a result. Have a great week my nerds. See you next time for more on how you can turn that impossible idea into a possibility.